right out of farm field. Take the red eye, and so we need a coffee. Look at this. Belgium chocolate on it. Mm. So we've Richard, got the guy. Richard yeah. English speaking. Yeah. Beautiful. Okay, this is the entrance. To St. Michael's Hotel in the Grand Palace Square of Brussels. Oh my God. That's what I want, a roaring fire, bed and breakfast. Oh, dream was gonna do come true. Hi, this is Kelly, and I am in beautiful Belgium. And this is Brussels behind me, and this is our hotel room window. Come and look. <laughs> and I'm going to introduce you to the Freemason who are staying here and take you on my day, my day arriving in Brussels and how magical this place is. Aren't these paintings everywhere on the buildings incredible? As some of you know, I was in movie effects, and here is my new effect with my brand new hat. <laughs> here it goes. Dan Doy is the most famous waffle shop in Belgium, a hundred year old recipe. Fast food, the dog chasing the cat. <laughs> I love it, breakfast included. And my favorite breakfast, fresh papaya. Woohoo! All right, here we are in, Be in Belgium, Brussels, Belgium, with the Freemasons. Hi, everybody. Hi. St. Michael's up at the top. There's one of our favorite restaurants right in the square. This is called the Grand Palace Square. It's, every bit of it is magical, inlaid in gold. And there is a St. Michael Hotel, which is where we're staying. And that is our bedroom right there, that big, large room up there in the middle. Is that incredible? Dream come true, staying right there. It's four o'clock in Brussels. I think this has to top Rio de Janeiro. This is the greatest office I've ever had.
best tea coffee shop in all of Brussels, Belgium, right here. And look what we found, a green juice in Brussels. This is the owner of the cafe in Brussels that we have fallen madly in love with that has green juice. So we're going to find out who he is. I told David he looks like a race car driver, but <laughs> we'll see. I just have race car drivers on my mind for some reason. David thinks he's a chef. That would make logical sense. That's why David's a statistician, because he's logical. <laughs> I'm searching for the greatest box of Belgium chocolate for Jared. I'm a cycling instructor at his club, Power Pilates Plus in Atlantic Beach, Florida. This is the Cookie Monster store. If you have a Cookie Monster within you, this is where you might want to stop and visit. Okay. That's where he had lunch. And on the, the face of this cathedral, though I think it's called like a capital building of Belgium, is all the people that made a difference in the history of Belgium. They're carved as statues on the face of that building. I need to get more information on that. And that's the Belgian Beer Museum right there. And oh, it's just magical. I want to remember this. On my deathbed, this moment and this feeling and this, oh my God, this grandness of human life and existence and creation. It's pretty incredible. If you like Brussels, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. My next YouTube will be from Antwerp, Belgium. <laughs>